Hi guys and welcome to another ESP32 technical tutorial. In this one, which is going to be relatively short because it's really simple to use, we're going to talk about a lux meter. Lux, apparently, that was a new phrase to me, lux, and apparently that's a measurement of light intensity. So what one can buy for about a dollar is a module called the BH1750FVI. BH1750FVI. And this is an I squared C module, tiny little micro, a tiny little IC on it, and we can connect it to the I squared C pins of our ESP32. So what can we do with it? Well, we read data from it. Simply, does uh, it's about the simplest possible I squared C device in that all one does is read 16 bits from it over and over again. And the value that we get back is the amount of light that's falling on the device. Now, unlike a light-dependent resistor or some other uh, uh, similar types of technology, this is measuring a uh, precise luminescence, which is measured in lux. And what that means is that uh, there's very little fluctuation in uh, setting it up once that uh, would set it up again. So if I am reading a value from it and you read the same value from it in your environment, we can be relatively safe that the same amount of light is falling on both of our devices. So it's a, it's not an arbitrary amount of light, it's a very prescribed measurable amount of light. The other thing is that this device is specifically filtered and analyzed and designed to measure visible light, meaning that other electromagnetic radiation, such as infrared spectrum or other values, are not going to cause triggers in this, only the visible light spectrum. All right, so that's a, that's a lot of words. Simplest thing to say is this is a module you can buy for a dollar, you solder it together, and you wire it up to your ESP32. Uh, it takes a power input, uh, an address line, and uh, the SDA data line and the SCL clock line. And then one reads data from it and we're good to go. So if I bring up my ESP32 and we look here, here is the C application that I'm using with it. And that's it. Simple as that. I'll make that available on the GitHub repository. Uh, basically, we go into a loop, we read 16 bits of data, we print out that 16 bits of data, we sleep for a period, and we go round and round again. That's about as simple a program as you can possibly get. Now, if we look at my console output, I've got it running here, it's telling me I've got 900 uh, lux, uh, the amount of light falling on it. Now, if I wave my hand or cast a shadow over the sensor, it drops. Make it bright again, it's there. And if I move my light away and cast less light on it, move the light back in, more light on it, we can see that it's actively measuring light. That's very simple to use. And uh, apparently these lux units, um, we can measure uh, daylight, sunlight, various other light intensities. And it's that's it. Nothing more to say to it than that. Very short tutorial, but an incredibly simple, easy to use module that you can wire into your ESP32 if you need to measure light intensities. If we're looking for a simple project, maybe for kids or just maybe for your own interest, uh, consider an ESP32 attached to this, put it outside your house and measure the light level intensity as it changes over time. Send it via Wi-Fi or Bluetooth uh, out onto the internet, record it in a table up on the cloud system and chart it over time to see, as you would expect, the light intensity changing as you cycle through day to night and then perhaps cloud cover and no cloud cover. Really simple little module. I hope you find some use in this and I'll talk to you again soon. Bye for now.